Hello my guys, welcome to another episode, working on the 2019 RAV4 once again. I have a new installation, shout out to Car Trim Home, send me this, this is a really cool uh, new product, I want to show you guys how to do the installation, super easy. With, with, with this new device, you're going to be able to check the pressure on your tires on your dash. Simple plug and play. We gotta get to the main control and it's right here. We have to remove this panel. And you know that any new vehicle has a TPMS sensors on your tires. So it's gonna work with your 2019, 2020 Toyota RAV4. First thing, we need to get to this panel. Release to and get to it. We don't have to remove the whole thing. There is only one screw in here. We need to remove this. Another clip. In this side, we will be able to just lift this panel so we can remove this one. Same tool. Once you have your panel like that, you don't have to remove it all the way. Pull on this top panel. You just have to pull it, be gentle, but we got it out. For the new part, like I said, it's a plug and play system. This is the new device and the new wire harness. This is a monitor that you have for your tires pressure system. We just need to unplug this clip. And unplug the new wire harness. This one is gonna go to the new control and these to the stack box. Also the kit came with this double sided tape. We can stick it next to it, somewhere down here. I'm gonna put it actually down here, away from everything. But before we do that, let's go inside the truck so we can check how the system works. We need to have 240 kPa on front and rear tires and 420 on the spare but don't worry about the spare you only focus on these two numbers 240 for both front and rear okay everything is ready I'm gonna turn it on Okay, let's move around, see if we can find the system. Okay, so it's already on. We didn't have this screen before. 
it looks like everything is working I think I need to drive around to start having some numbers or probably when I have to give it some time so there you go we can start reading everything well on the website it says that it was not gonna be PSI it's gonna be KPA but look at that PSI so it's reading PSI which is good because that's what we normally use in here I'm super amazed with this I like it a lot if we go through the manual you this is what I always use but if you go to the right right in there we have the tire pressure amazing this is so simple plug and play right now we have 33 on the driver 33 on the passenger front 34 on the driver rear 33 on the passenger rear PSI I like that now let's check how much PSI we need to have in the tires we need to have 35 PSI on both here we are at the driver's side It's pretty accurate. This is the driver rear. Yeah, this one is the one that it says 34. It's pretty accurate right there. Passenger rear. We went on that one too. And passenger front. Yeah, we good. I put it next to the box with the velcro nice and tight in there now I can put the panel back on Once again, shout out to Car Trim Home for this new device. Link is going to be in the description if you want to get this smart car TPMS tire pressure monitoring system. I hope you like this little episode guys. If you have any questions, please comment down below. I'm going to be happy to help. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next one. Peace. Mm -hmm.